It's time again for Film Focus. Here's Mike Lateman with interesting movies in local theaters. If you managed to find Detective Pikachu playing early last week, then well done. There will be many more showings to enjoy this weekend, but if you're not interested or have already seen it, then let me introduce you to a couple of Korean films. I mean, really, it's about time we branched out a bit, isn't it? Welcome to another edition of Film Focus. I'm Mike Lateman. From young director Jong Ta Won comes Miss and Mrs. Cops, a comedy crime caper starring Yi Song Yong and La Miran, two sisters in law working together at a police department. Mi Young, who used to be considered the major crime unit's top cop, is stationed behind a desk after having a baby. She leads uneventful yet peaceful days, handling civil complaints and looking after her son and unemployed husband at home. One day, an overly enthusiastic detective, Ji Hae, the sister in law, is consigned to Mi Young's team. Neither is happy about sitting next to the other, but differences are pushed aside when a woman who had come in to file a report is run over in front of them. They discover the woman is the victim of spy cam. Porn. It has been threatened it will go up on a community site. Now, the two find themselves in the middle of an intense suicide case. You can tell from the title that this isn't going to be a heartwarming story. There are most likely going to be tears. Yumi's fiancé Tegu is currently working overseas in Nagoya, Japan. She decides to travel there to see him, only to find that he is in love with another woman. And not only in love, but engaged. Yumi falls into despair and wanders around the unfamiliar city of Nagoya. She happens upon the Endpoint Cafe and Guest House, where she decides to stay as a guest, meeting the people there and hearing their various stories. Here, in an unfamiliar place, she meets new people. Her wounds slowly begin to heal and she learns to move on. Memories of a dead end is more about trying to find joy in the simple act of meaningless existence than trying to do so through specific life experiences. It's just a short, simple film about emotional healing. Good breakup movies can be hard to come by, something that Memories of a Dead End knows all too well. So if you're feeling down, well, this could be for you.